Now I know you might not be convinced that microservices is the way to go and that's okay. But let's consider a few benefits of microservices. It improves modularity by making it easier to understand, develop and test the system. It reduces complexity by having a smaller code base per microservice. It allows you to update functionality with no or minimal effect on the rest of the system. It greatly reduces the chance of breaking something in an unrelated part of the system. It allows for more controlled collaboration in a team of developers that are working on the same system at the same time. It enables continuous delivery and development of large, complex applications by applying the principle of divide and conquer. Services can be deployed independently without having to wait for the entire system to be published. It creates an architecture that is highly scalable. It allows for deployments to multiple cloud and on-premise infrastructure environments. You can take advantage of emerging technologies such as frameworks, programming languages, etc. while evolving an existing system. And finally, it allows new team members to become productive quicker since they can start developing new functionality without having to learn the entire system.